Is your reputation more important than our children? To put it plainly. But I need you to step it up. I need you to be there when I'm not. That's why we moved here. Parents in Prosper feel... Parents feel deceived and they feel betrayed and they feel hurt and angry. The reason why Dr. Morgan Grahovec... There was no notification that we received whatsoever. ...still can't believe. In May, this man, Frank Paniagua, was arrested on child sex abuse charges. He was a bus driver accused of assaulting two young elementary school sisters more than 100 times over a school year on his bus. He was fired, and the district never publicly said anything about it. There should have been um, an email sent out to the entire school. Until a lawsuit came its way last week, over 100 days after the arrest. Children need to be identified and interviewed as soon as possible because memory fades over time. Dr. Grahovic has two children in the district. One attended the school where Peniagua dropped off children. She's also a child psychologist. In hysteria and distress. Before the board Monday night, she underscored the harm in waiting to reveal such an arrest. If there were any other victims. So the longer that you wait, the harder it is to get a child to report abuse accurately. And a law firm representing the two young girls says it's reviewing additional reports of abuse received in the following days. The delay in transparency. I hope that, you know, districts will use this as a teachable moment. Grahovic hopes other districts won't repeat. In Prosper, I'm Matt Howerton.